Welcome back. This is Miss Sam from 123A. I hope you're having a cool day. On this video, we will solve a problem using the data on a stem and leaf plot. Awesome. Let's read this together and find the keywords. The stem and leaf plot, okay, big keyword, shows the height of toys. Okay, the heights of toys. Possible heights are between 0 0.1 and 5.0. Okay, very important guys, here I see decimals. Let's look at the stem and leaf plot. We see toys height, stem 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, and leaf, it has a lot of leaves. And here is the key. This is very important. It says one line five means a score of 1.5. Okay, how do we interpret that? Zero line six equals to 0 0.6 because this line is substituted by a decimal point. Let's do this one. We see the stem two and leaf eight. This is equal to 2.8. As simple as that. Let's keep reading. What is the difference between the highest and lowest height shown in the stem and leaf plot? Okay, it says what's the difference between the highest and lowest heights? What do we do now? To find the difference on a math problem, you need to subtract. Well, that sure helps. What do we subtract? The highest. Let's find the highest. So the highest is 4 and 9. 4.9 and the lowest is 0 line 6 which means 0 decimal point 6. Let's subtract them. 4.9 this is the highest minus 0 point 6 this is the lowest 9 minus 6 is 3 decimal point 4 minus 0 4. This is the difference. Now let's look for the answer on our options. Is it F? 4.9. This looks like this is the highest value. Do we choose that one? No, it's not the right answer. Definitely not. What about 43? Okay, I see a 4.3 here, which this is if somebody didn't look at the key and instead of saying that these are decimals, they did 49 minus 6, that is 43. But this is without decimal points. That is why it's so important to look at this key. So do we choose 43? Oh, another trick. Unbelievable. Definitely not. What about 4.3? Well, here we see that this is our answer. So should we choose this one? That might be it. But I have to check all the other answers because that's a cool thing to do. Yes, guys, let's keep this as a possible, but let's check J just in case. Is it 49? I see that this is 4.9, so this is like if somebody didn't read the key and only chose the highest score. So this is the highest and no decimals. Should we choose J? This looks hairy. I think that's not the right answer. Definitely not. So... H is the right answer, 4.3. Once again, we solved this problem in less than 5 minutes. Who knew math was so simple? Make sure you also check these other cool math videos where you can learn a lot of math and become a math expert. Remember to like, subscribe, leave your comments, and share this video with other kids that are learning math. 